is the lot of them! Damn you, where is it? Where's the real mask? Show me where you are hiding it! Please, I swear to you, it was there. I don't know where, where it- Yes, yes, and of course, the lieutenant knows nothing either, correct? The beating Kurt gave him, it loosened his memory, hmm? You draw fairly well, eh, Tom? For a cripple, you know these creatures, eh? Vampires, werewolves, Frankenstein's monster. They are Hollywood. Fake. Forget them, my friend. There are real monsters in this world. Look at me, Tuttle. I am a real monster. Now tell me where the mask is, or these last few moments you have on Earth will be terrible ones indeed. Please, I swear, I don't- Look that! Damn you! You goddamn lousy- Ugh! Kurt, Ernst, take them downstairs. You and Martin tear that rag shop to pieces. The rest of us will search here. Wait, please! You sad, stupid little man. All that power, and you wasted on a worthless existence in this decrepit hovel. It would be different when the mask is upon my face, where it will serve the highest purpose imaginable. Fulfilling the sacred dream of mine here in Folk, and I will wear the mask here, Tunnel. With or without your cooperation. Yes! This is ridiculous! It's all junk! We should just burn this sty and sift the stinking ashes! Ray? Ray? Listen. The mask. It's our only chance. We have to figure out a way for one of us to get to it. But I don't know where it is. I don't. Maybe I did something with it when I made the copies. I just can't think. Kurt! We found nothing. Only garbage. Hmm. Same upstairs. We did find one thing of interest, however. Our uncooperative friend here has a daughter. Tell me, uh, Tuttle. You're Emily. You are expecting her home soon, yes? No, you can't! She's- ah! If you care for her, then tell me where it is! Tell me! Otherwise, I swear I'm gonna cut your precious little girl up into wet stripes for the neighborhood strays to eat in the gutter! Do not under- Axel! Outside! Come quickly! What? It's Wong Kai Ying! They appear from nowhere! God him! The Iron Triad is here! Stoltenberg! We come for the mask! So, I see we're not the only ones who survived Kyoto. Pity, I had hoped she about this people would destroy you. Shiobata and his people sleep fitfully. They hunt the mask no longer. No matter. The hunt is all but ended. The mask is well within our grasp. Soon we will reshape this infested planet and vermin like you and the others will trouble us no more. <laughs> what foolishness! You must deal with us and the others now, Stoltenberg. Not soon. Others? What others? Are you blind? Look about you! Axel! The lightning! Zahin Zahir! What suit us Earth Ninjas? Everyone, in close! Pick your targets! God, I am sorry I ever found that mask. Me too, brother. Me too. Ah, now what? Killer, maybe it's the cops. I don't think so, Ray. From what I can make out, I'd say it's the exact opposite. It was a mistake for you to come here after Nucci. That's so? Think after Peru we just give up on the mask, eh? That's funny. Almost as funny as any of you thinking you got a chance of getting out of here alive, you airy bat! Danny! Ah, what the hell? Look! Oh my god! Oh boy. No. Oh no. Emily. What have you done to my daddy? You leave him alone, you big bullies, or I swear you'll be really, really sorry. E Emily? Relax, Dad. I can handle these history channel rejects. Incredible. To find the mask at last, and the possession of this silly child, and to think for a moment I was frightened. What is the phrase, Kurt? About taking candy from a baby? Ray, stop! No! She's just a little girl! Dad, cool it, will ya? God, you're so embarrassing. Okay, you rotten little Hitler boys. You wanna fight? I'll give you one. Food fight! <laughs> pretty good, huh, Dad? This is not a joke. Well, I think it's pretty funny. Stupid little girl! That is no child's play thing you wear. No toy for you to prance about in. Countless men have died all over the world for that mask. So? Emily! So, I have no qualms about removing it from the corpse of a dead brat. Me neither. Okay, joke's over. Now you're gonna be sorry! Now, my brothers, we live or die for the mask! Attack my followers! The mask is ours! Nanny, 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 you can't get me! Axel, his neck! I think it's broken! Leave him! Get the girl's father! The rest of you keep Antonucci's dogs back! I'll get the other weapons for the van! I can't leave Emily alone out there! Don't worry about her! Worry about us! We're not wearing the mask! Callaway, look out! As I was saying, this is gonna be very messy. The best we can do is try to stay out of harm's way. <laughs> you 
guys really stink. Boy, is your kung fu lousy. Let me show you my pissed off little girl kung fu style. It's the best. <laughs> Feel my clean your room sweep attack with too much homework fix. <laughs> Watch my crying tantrum boxing style. <laughs> and finally, my 1,000 nights without Nintendo kick. Hey, what's this? Where'd this come from? It is a poison needle, little one. Poison? Ugh, gross. It is a fast-acting poison. Soon you will be asleep forever, and the mask will be mine. Meh, I'm no baby. I don't take naps. Here, you take it. You look like you could use the rest. Night-night, sleepyhead. Hey, where's everybody going? I thought you chickens wanted to fight. They're going to hell, Froline. As are you. I'm Fetusin. Oh, you dick. Emily? Hurry! Search for our body! You jerks! You blew up our house! All my stuff was in there! What am I gonna wear tomorrow? You big stupid jerks! No! No, it cannot be! Oh yes, it can't so be! Now quit crying, you big baby, and take it like a... Say, what's that noise? Oh, it's a car. Emily, look out! No, not again! Ray! L Lieutenant, are you alright? Lieutenant! Oh no. Emily. Where's Emily? I can't believe it! We got her! We got her good! Shut up! We didn't get nothing without that mask. Lorenzo turned the car around. We gotta look for that mask. Looking for something? Ah! Whoops! This is where I get off. Later, boys. You remember, if you stay, you drive! Jeez, mister. You look terrible. Please, help, help me. That is the sort of help your dear father can expect, my Liebchen. If you do not surrender the mask to me this instant, D daddy Emily, don't do it! Don't give it to them! They'll kill you! Listen to me, little girl. No more games, no more jokes. Understand? Your father's fate is in your hands. So tell me now, what will it be, Emily? The mask, or your father's life? All right, I'll give it to you. Just stop hurting my daddy, please. Thy mask! Thy mask! Emily, give it! Give it to me! No. I'll let my dad give it to you. Give it to him, Dad! No! I'll show you to pick on defenseless little girls, you rats! How do you like it? How's that taste, huh? How's that feel? I know you're never supposed to hit a lady, but then again, you're no lady. You're a lousy Nancy! Ladies and gentlemen, the winner and still champ! Me! I am the greatest of all time! You were wrong, Tuttle. You may have triumphed, but you've won nothing. Axel, no! The petrol! You kill us all! Exactly. I'll hit <laughs> Sucker on, remember? But how come I'm okay? I'm not even burnt. Not even a little bit. Oh, that's because I put you in my mouth. In your mouth? Yeah, that's why you're a little sticky. Say, there's the lieutenant. Is he dead? Nah, just conked out. As for these others, well, there's nothing I can do. Except build them, of course. My long face, sweetie. We won, didn't we? Daddy, stop it. Stop what? Stop being big head. Now, M. Please, Daddy, please. Take off the mask. Take it off now and don't ever put it on again. It makes people do bad things and it makes people die and I don't want you or anyone else to die like mommy. Please. I love you. Please. Oh god. Emily. I waited so long. So long to hear you say that to me again. To hear you say anything to me again. To hear your beautiful voice. To have my baby back. I love you too, Emily. Oh god, I love you too. The next thing I know, I wake up in a Motel 6, 40 miles away. A lump on my hand, a grand in my pocket, and the keys of those Nazis' cars. Ah, and this ring. And yes, those diamonds are real. Man alive, that must be worth a fortune. A few more like that and the guy could retire for life. Hmm, those triad guys were wearing tons of this stuff too. The Tuttles sound like good people. I hope they're both okay. Yeah, somehow I get the feeling they're alright. In fact, I'm sure they are. 
What I'm not sure of is, what did they do with that damn mask? Well, that's that. Good riddance. We can decide if we want to toss the key when we get to Hong Kong. I feel weird, Dad. I hope we're doing the right thing. I hope so too, sweetie. But you know, if there was any reason at all for us to find that mask, well, maybe it was because someone decided you and I deserved a new lease on life. And the jewelry and the briefcases of money we found in the German's car, they'll give us that new life. Our new life, Pumpkin. Now come on, Em. We've got us a plane to catch. Thanks again, Mr. Pierce. I hope we'll be doing business again soon. Not very soon, I'm afraid. My daughter and I are leaving on an overdue vacation. I'm jealous! Well, you two enjoy yourselves, then. Take care. Thanks. We will!